following Fatal 4-Way Contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from Pineville, West Virginia, weighing in at 216 pounds, Heath Slater. Big opportunity here tonight for Heath Slater. And you'd have to imagine his kids are watching this one, cheering on their old man. Allow me to point out just how focused he appears to be here tonight. I noticed the same thing, Cole. In fact, it looks to me like he'll settle for nothing short of a victory here in this one. coming up here guys which means believe it or not we're going to be sending away three of these superstars with a loss here tonight and a win here would go a long way in proving he's as good as he says he is sounds like you're doubting him Cole let me tell you something you never want to doubt this guy trust me One thing we've learned about Zack Ryder over the years is that you can't keep him down. Yeah, he's literally ruled himself to where he is at this point in his career. Guys, this match will undoubtedly go a long way in determining just who is the most dominant superstar. That's what makes this match so great. These superstars clearly have a point to prove here tonight and will likely do anything necessary. is about as scary as they come, ladies and gentlemen. I'm willing to bet this guy gives plenty of superstars nightmares, Michael. And the good news is that he appears to be coming into tonight with a little extra motivation. Yeah, and he's really had a chip on his shoulder as of late, and it seems to have been helping him.
One of the aspects to this type of match which makes it so interesting is that it can lead to the formation of unlikely alliances. Just another thing to have to worry about when you're competing against three other superstars all at the same time. And guys, you can almost literally feel the electricity in the air for this Hell in a Cell match. And listen to this San Jose crowd. They are so incredibly passionate about their WWE action. And it shows. Tell me your thoughts on Heath Slater. In a fatal four-way, there are lots of moving parts. What does he need to do to separate himself here? Hell in a Cell is one of the few matches you simply cannot leave if you don't like where the match is going. He has his hands full for sure. I'll give credit where credit's due. The chance for Big E are definite. The WWE Universe certainly agrees that New Day rocks, and this powerhouse is a major reason for that. But ugh, I feel sick after acknowledging that. He's Slater showing us how to get it done. He lands a jarring forearm. a hard shot what a strike come on Corey we all know how you love to start your day with a giant bowl of booty -o cereal no matter how you look at it Big E is one of the most popular superstars in WWE I personally love starting each day with a bowl of booty -os. sometimes I'll even have two bowls when Big E steps through that curtain the WWE Universe loses their minds and that's not by accident he lands a jarring forearm Got it. Down to the floor. Whoops, not even close. What was he thinking? This is some great offense by Sawyer Fulton. And there's the elbow. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. He wants no part of the outside. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Man, that got him good. He landed a perfectly placed strike. That'll send a message to your adversary, all right. Wow, he just slammed him with ease. Big E starting to weaken a little. This is absolutely not how he envisioned this four-way match going, guys. I'm really disappointed in what we're seeing from him here tonight. Quick cover by Heath Slater. And Ryder kicks out. Yeah, seem to be just testing the waters a bit there. This is some great offense by Heath Slater. This is some great offense by Heath Slater. He's on his heels. He's always up for a challenge, and tonight is no different. If he doesn't find a way to mount a sustained offense soon, you can bet this Hell in a Cell match will be over. And you can put a check in the loss column for him. Don't write him off just yet, guys. From what I see, these guys are pretty evenly matched at this point. Bringing it back between the ropes. Check out Big E's offense. Now that one well scouted. A move like that is completely unnecessary. Unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. Ooh! An early pin attempt. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. And a savage clothesline. A sickening thud. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Look out! Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, he turns it around. 
Heath Slater showing us how to get it done. Watch out, E-Train. The sleeper slam from Slater. That might be enough. This isn't good. I don't think Zack Ryder knows where he is. The unfortunate reality is he might not get up, which wouldn't shock me one bit. Talk about a beating he's taken here tonight. He may have discovered his favorite move. Ain't no stopping him now. This could do it. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. This is amazing. The back region taking the brunt of the punishment here. He's Slater. Now back to the ring. Unleashing it for the second time now. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. Apparently, he can summon this kind of energy at will. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. He clearly did his homework heading into tonight. At some point, the referee may want to think about stopping this one before somebody gets seriously injured. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Zack Ryder turns it around. He's really putting his athleticism on display here. He's still not moving, guys. He might be out, Cole. Uh-oh. What is Zack Ryder? Fault in! Big splash! Slater's going to be singing a little off-key after that. Man, back in the ring now. Check out Big E's offense. He's calling for it. Big E trying to get inside his opponent's head. What else is new? Sawyer Fulton. Ouch! What a gut wrench suplex. Warm up the bus. This one is over. That'll readjust your spine. He wants to do this in the ring. Here he goes for the win. One, two. Chalk up another one. Here is your winner, Big E. What an amazing closing few moments we saw here in this fatal four-way match. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. The crowd here tonight certainly seemed to appreciate the efforts. What a great match.